Alright, so that was like two seconds later. And I'm going to pump this into strength, so when I get to Act 2, I don't want to be that guy. Alright, I don't want to be that guy. And by the way, like I said, I'm going to redo all my stats when I actually get the ability to do so. Um, after I've gotten Bone Spear at level 20, and we're going to go back into Bone Spear and remove all the points out of my character. Um, I'm going to actually look at my other one before I do it, my other Necromancer. And we're going to move all of our points, pretty much try and make an exact replica so I don't die. Um, I didn't have any struggle with my other Necromancer, but it's just like, I don't want to do it on this one. Like I don't want to be a scrub. I want to be that guy. I want to be that guy. <clears throat> God, I'm thirsty. I think after I get this quest done, I'm going to get a drink. A very large drink. A very juicy drink. That sounded really strange. Juicy juice. I always thought that was the funniest shit as a kid. Juicy juice. What the fuck? That's like the laziest shit you can name a beverage. Juicy juice. I don't know what else to call it. Juicy. It's juice. It's juicy juice. Kids love juice. I was that kid that did not like juice, by the way. I don't care for juice. I don't care for juice as an adult. I don't even like juice. I mean, I've made juice. It's good. This is sounding really suggestive, and I feel like it is, and I'm very sorry. Um, but it is suggestive. When you're making juice, you're grinding and pumping and smashing. and Oh, man, it's pretty intense. Oh, God. By the way, this is why, I, like I said, why I like Necromancer. Spam in a doorway, kill everything. I don't know how Necromancer fares in PvP, because I don't play PvP. I don't ever play. I played RuneScape, but I never even played PvP. Alright, let's go. Let's say this right now. RuneScape was the reason I hated playing Mage, because RuneScape Mage was bullshit. You could only do, I think, 130 damage was your max damage. When I played it way back in the day, I didn't like buying things, because I'm this kind of guy that likes to loot and random loot. So, you know, find what you make. That's what I'm trying to get at. I played... All right, let's talk about RuneScape for like 10 minutes, tops, and then we're going to drop this damn topic because I try and exclude this from happening in my life as much as I can. All right, play as Melee, and I had I had a quest cape. I was that guy. I wasn't a traitor. I didn't talk to anybody. I, oh, I barely got that quest cape because I had to talk to somebody stupid enough to understand what was going on. I was a member. I was that guy. I paid with my own money, though. So it wasn't like I was like, Mom, I need money. No, I actually had... I did odd jobs like every kid did. But I, I saved up and actually bought real things. But back then, RuneScape wasn't as, ex as expensive. <sighs> I got a skill cape. I got 99 cooking. It was my first untrimmed. What else? I played from when it first came out. And it was really ugly. Stopped playing around high school, my sophomore year. When I was a big dumb fat kid, I just said, I don't like this game anymore. It's taken over my life. No, I'm just kidding. It didn't take over my life, but I don't know. I like playing it because I like the quests. I like Slayer. I was really high level. Pretty damn high. I'm not going to lie. I think I was like 88 or 90 or something of that such. I was pretty damn high. That's, that's how high level I was. Um, it wasn't that I was hooked, okay? I did play that game in middle school at lunch every now and again. I didn't play it every damn day. I went outside and played football with my friends. Back when we could beat the shit out of each other when the teachers weren't paying attention, that was so much fun. We played super hardcore tackle football. It was fun. Anyways, um... Oh God, I'm gonna run out of potion. I'm gonna run out of potion. Ew, he gooed all over the place when he died. Anyways, um, yeah. So, I played the RuneScape, I got a quest cape, like I said. I don't like to say that it's a good thing that I played this game, but it is a, I mean, it does have a really good economy. That's what I like about the game. It's pretty cool, the economy of it. Kind of like TF2 and Hats. Not really, but kind of. Anyways, um, I'm trying to remember my accolades before you got, I had all the milestones done, you know, the uh, achievement milestones, like the little doodly dad like stand on top of oh god I don't even want to try and remember the name of the buildings in the main cities Valador go do all the shit in Valador oh my god I don't even want to talk about this game this game makes me uncomfortable to talk about you know I had all the shit pretty much um I can even remember my armor loadout I had Torags when Torags was really goddamn good 
I had the Obsidian Cape, because that was the best cape in the game at the time, playing. I played until what's it called came out. Um, Dungeoneering, I stopped playing after that. So I played pretty late in the game. I had quite a knowledge of the game. Uh, and like I said, I never talked to people. I didn't obsess over it. I played it maybe an hour or two a day at the least. Um, you know, I wrote more than anything and played video games. I still do. Um, God, I'm just making sure you guys know this so you can make fun of me for it. Um, oh my, that is something fierce. I'm going to retreat, get some potions, sell, and I'll continue the story. BRB. Okay, so anyways, as I was going to say, I had quite a plethora of crap in RuneScape. It was not like a bad thing. I had, I don't even want to try it. I had at least 20 mil. You know, back in the day, a mil, that was a lot, okay? A million's a lot in general. A million is a large number in this game to get, by the way. Um, I have like two, or I actually have money cap almost on my other uh, character. Um, anyways, I had, I'm trying to remember, I had Dragon Bootsies, I had Abyssal Whip, Full Torags when I used it. I used, um, I think my lowest stats were Mage stats. Definitely magic was like my lowest. I had a really high prayer for some reason. Because when I first played the game, all I did was kick the shit out of cows, keep the bones, and just beat the crap out of cows and rinse and repeat. And I made the hard leather thing. I did everything. I started up as that free-to-play scrub. I went into a membership. Never gotten clans. No crazy shit like that. I wasn't that kind of guy. Um, what else? I'm trying to remember. I... Oh, God, it was embarrassing. I, I feel like it's bad, but the game really did introduce me to a lot of things I like about RPGs. Um, it's kind of important, I guess. I mean, it's I mean, RuneScape itself, not a bad game. The people that play it, bad, yes. We all know this. I mean, and my friend and me, we'd play on our own private server. Just, you know, fun PvP, just for funsies, all the items in the game. And it, it did give us idea of strategy you know how do you actually counteract some of the shit in the game and it was really cool we do that with every update that came out you know new stuff test out the new things it was pretty fun and it was pretty cool not gonna lie i like the game my favorite skill in the game to this day was either fletching no, i'm just kidding i hated fletching i had like a ridiculously high. i was like 87 i was hell bent on getting fucking 99 fletching son I was like, no, I'm going to do this. It's going to happen. I'm going to get 99. Don't tell me I'm not going to do it. It's going to happen. I tried 99 magic. I go for alking. I didn't like it. I said, fuck it. And I did cooking because cooking was the easiest. And I even made profit off of it. I mean, and it taught me a lot about econ economics. There we go. That's the word I'm searching for. This all makes sense of what I'm doing, by the way. So just thought you should know. Uh, <laughs> Oh, I hate Bone Mage minions. They're terrible. Anyways, um, what was I gonna say? Oh yes. Um, so like I said, I was hell bent on it. But my favorite skill, hands down, in that game was 99 Slayer. That was like the one thing. I only knew a a guy in high school. It's kind of bad. I mean, it was like I didn't idolize this guy, but I respected the amount of hours he put in the game. And that's not mine. I can't use that. Anyways. That's not mine. I can't use that. Oh, shit. What did you do? What did you do, Golem? Get back there and fight. Get your ass in the game, soldier. Jesus, I'm gonna die. Okay, that was... Oh, my God. What is hitting me? I'm scared all of a sudden. Anyways, um... I can't tell. The recording is in the way of his health bar, by the way. Shit. Stop. Leave me alone. Okay, anyways, um... I guess Slayer. I love Slayer. I know it was the most repetitive bullshit, like, skill. I mean, it was a skill of all things, but that was how I made so much money. That's how I got so many good items. I had like six abyssal whips. I sold them and made uber amounts of money. Oh my god, this is just bringing back horrible memories. Not that people made fun of me for playing it, because no one cared. It was... I didn't tell anybody I played this game. <laughs> I'm making sure, because I'm pretty sure I've not found him yet. We're trying to find the... what's his name? The, the hammer dude. The smith. We're trying to find the smith. And yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, anyways. It's a slayer. I was like hell-bent on getting 99 slayer. I never did. I got like 80-something slayer. But it felt so badass to get slayer up. I mean, 
It was grind, yes. It was kill X amount of creatures for X amount of times and X amount of place to get X amount of items. Use X item to use X item. But you felt like a badass doing it. I don't know what the hell it was about it. But when you went to the Slayer Dungeon the first time in the whatever the hell place that was on the the thing I'm thinking. I don't even remember. The caves. You went to the caves um, where you fought the cave creatures or whatever the hell. I think they're called Black Beast. I'm not sure. But they had the black mask. They had that mask that was really hard to get and part of the Slayer helmet. I have a horrible flashbacks going on right now in my head, by the way. Um, I loved killing them. I was like, oh yeah, I'm here to kill the... Uh, I'm here to kill cave beasts. Yeah, I'm here to do that. I'd be like, yeah, yo dog, by the way, make sure you wear your... Whatever you had to do to make sure you didn't get hit by them. They're like, oh yeah, oh yeah. And then you see some idiot running through the cave dying, basically, because he didn't have... A, he probably didn't have very good food. He didn't have sharks. Sharks? No, ma monkfish. Monkfish, that's what it was. I'm remembering so much. I'm a horrible person. I just know. Saying this is damning me. And there's the smith, by the way. He's pretty easy. This is why I love being necromancer. Anyways, I leveled up. I don't even notice. Anyways, um... Uh, what was I saying? Oh, yeah. It just felt good. I don't know. Killing massive amounts of creatures, genociding creatures, is not really a cool thing in retrospect. <laughs> But in that game, it was awesome. You got so much money for doing it. You got like Uber items. You could get like, what was it? Banshees could drop some item. Then you got herbs. You always got random herbs, and herbs were like, you always got like these grimy herbs. You'd wipe the grime off. They'd be worth a load of money. I feel like a horrible person because I really want to get back into playing. Like, no, I'm just kidding. I don't want to do that. You want this mall, by the way? So, like I said, though, can't lie about the RuneScape life I used to have. But like I said, it wasn't like a life. It was like, I played the game, it was fun, yeah. I gotta make some room. Gonna make a tight squeeze. Okay, so, I'm gonna go beep boop. We're gonna just go do this right now, and then I'm gonna end the episode before I have another freaking nightmare about this. Uh, stay a while. Greetings. No, say it, you bastard. I hate you. Don't I bring this to Charcy? Yeah, we bring the thing to Charcy, and we're gonna imbue our wand. Yeah, this game makes me feel so much better about my life. <laughs> okay, so we're gonna imbue. No, 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 no. There we go. And there's what? I, I, no socketed. There's a socket in it. You gotta be kidding me. Whatever. So that's that quest. Um, I'll sell the items and do all the stuff for the next episode. See you guys then. It's gonna be the last one. Act one.